this song is about fighting for peace or fighting for equality and it's like nothing's more peaceful than a cloud or like a sunny blue sky. My name is Hamid Shegumaru and I was born in Lagos, Nigeria. I moved to the States when I was about five. Currently I am living in Los Angeles, California. <laughs> I've always been interested in making film and drawing and painting. Being Nigerian, you're taught there's no money in art. So I went and got a degree in computer science. There's this duality of like who I am. There's the very traditional African side where it's like, you also have this liberal, progressive, American raised kid. I met Nana back in like, I think 2019 or 2018. I think for this song that he wanted, the 10 and two, it's like everything that happened last year, the emotion, the police brutality, all of that. Once we saw the location and they had the TV installation, it was like, oh, ding, 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 that's an idea. Like, one of the things I wanted to do was to have Nana and Elton, who's also on the song, like, in a black background where it's just like, the main focus would just be them. Even placing Elton on like the blue sky background, the song is about fighting for peace or fighting for equality and it's like nothing's more peaceful than a cloud or like a sunny blue sky. There's another scene where we had them, the backdrop was a tie-dye kind of backdrop. So I think those little accidental things make the whole video cool. The video of the the girl, the little girl in the car driving, it's, that was all Nana's idea. If you're out, your police stop you. We're all just trying to make it home. How much that weigh on our parents? It's like, hey, I'm just gonna, I'll be back and we go and there's like, that's the worry they have. What if, you know, that's my daughter and she has an altercation with the police? Everyone's energy on set was amazing. Like even the owner of the venue, he was there very helpful with the TV installation. Peace handling the spotlight, making sure it's following them. Ernest plays the guitar. He can set up the drum pattern for us and he can, be the engineer for this. No matter what you do, even if it's something you like, it's gonna feel like work at a certain point. But when you're doing something with people you, you know, and it's like fun, it doesn't feel like work. I don't know all the answers to directing and filmmaking and I'm learning and they're learning. So I think when I listen to the songs or listen to something, certain songs just evoke emotion. How do I convey this? How do I get you to feel this thing? For me, it starts with what I'm hearing and what I feel. Even you may have an idea of what you're going for, but be receptive at least to take criticism. I like dark tones and warm colors. Like you're getting, you get the warmth feeling from the video. One of the things I like doing in videos, at least when editing, is like just have the screen go black for a while. Not too long, but just long enough to be like, all right, and see where that plays in with the song as well.